And we're on the streets right now looking for hot fashions and, you know, some of those fashions that are not too hot. Tell us a bit about your fashion. Basically, I don't conform to just going for brands. I don't praise a brand. I just stay true to myself and I thrift and I find whatever I like. Okay, so you're a thrifter. A thrifter. So what inspires your style? My moods. Your moods? <laughs> yeah. So today, when you wake feeling, up, it's a different it's, type of style. Yeah, I look different every day. Okay. What inspires you? Uh, you know, I don't know. I've always been sort of into a lot of eclectic music and uh, <laughs> very drawn to a lot of the musicians that I listen to. They're, they're sort of um, fusion of sound and vision. Uh, at a very early age, I started listening to David Bowie. And okay. I got really into Ziggy Stardust. I started really exploring, like, you know, fashion through music. Individuality, that's my thing. That makes you different. That's, that's basically what I focus on, being different from everybody else. Weave or natural hair? Natural hair. <laughs> Why? I don't deal with the weave. I, don't, I got four sisters. All my sisters except <laughs> one got their real hair in their head. Natural beauty, real hair. I got to put my fingers through it, let me know it's real. <laughs> Don't try to do what look good on somebody else, like how everybody try to do dreads and everybody don't yeah. look good with dreads. You know what I'm saying? Like whatever works for you, that's what you need to do. It's like every year, like you know, every year um, we change our style yeah. up. And I guess this summer it's the camel cargo. But I, I like blue jean jacket, you know, nice okay. little jacket. You know, he got the trues. Okay, uh, true religion. So what would you call this style? That's a true fit. This is just my uh, casual walk in the streets, you know, post gym style. <laughs> post gym style. You know. What inspired that hairstyle? Like? Well, actually, uh, about four years ago, one of my buddies got his spiked up and gelled, and I was rocking the bowl cut. So I was like, you know what? I think that looks good. So I did it, gelled it up, and I was like, all right, low maintenance, 24 hour hold. That's all you need. Yeah. Well, my style is free. I, it's a freestyling. It's I don't care too much of what people think. Um, I do me. I, I I pick what I feel, how I feel. One day I might feel like uh, Dominique Devereaux from Dynasty, so I might do a high shoulder blazer or something. Or one day I might feel like Carrie, so I might do a powder pink. And so I felt like a hip hop genie. Like um, okay. I'm, I'm I'm a genie, and I added a little color. Like I'm just and I'm. We went to Mac for the first time and we got a bottle of lipstick. So oh. it, it pulled everything together. Yes. So, and you know, it's not it. what you wear, it's how you, how wear, you wear it. Fashion is 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 more of about you pull your own inspiration. I am my inspiration when I wake up. When I wake up I say, Hey, D Dior, you you inspire me to do something new. And you have to look up as other people as a muse and not more of a of a, a clone. Don't be a clone of what you see on TV. Yes, you have Christian Louboutins on. What what, what 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 else can you offer? If you have Christian Louboutin, and you know, a lot of people style off of what they see off TV. Mm -hmm. I style me on how I'm feeling. Check us out, truestarisdot.com.